Is that one not one ball? Nope, that's just a... That should be another one. We are just fishing. Oh. Nope. That's a broken one. That's the one we need. Hi everyone, and welcome to part one of our transmission swap for our $1,000 to $50,000 challenge, where we start off with $1,000 and through fixing and flipping, aim to make $50,000 in profits. In this two-part clip, we will be tackling the removal and installation for a replacement gearbox for this 2003 Nissan 350 GT Skyline. This entire job will be split into two videos. This is mainly because of the sheer amount of footage I managed to get with this video originally compromising a nearly three hours worth of footage, but also because as this video is being made, there are still a couple of small jobs left to complete. In this clip, we will be focusing on the removal of the original gearbox, showing off our multi-tool Hayden and prep for the installation of the replacement unit. So with that brief intro out of the way, let's get to removing some bolts and installing a couple of like buttons for extra good luck with this gearbox setup. We're gonna need it. Do you want to turn it around? Mm. Hey! Boom. Hey. 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 And then you want to slide that off. Oh, yeah. There she goes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's going to chuck it. Yeah, don't, don't do that because you're going to get Oh, one in. I like chucking stuff. Oh, there's just a clip at top. I just take out all the bolts I see. No, 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 Hayden, just take out every bolt. No, 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 no. That's the answer. No, 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 no,
Safe to safe for communities together. I think that's the police safety. It is the police, you should probably know that. So you take this off, it's done by the starter motor, there's bolts on the back of this. <laughs> so we need the flex place so we can't destroy that. <laughs> Um, so, the way you take one of these off is you do it through the, the plate thing down the bottom. This is where rattle guns really come in handy. Uh, back there. Smart people to prove you're smart. So, if you've got a really good rattle gun, you can just <laughs> take them out. But we do not have a really good rattle gun. I was going to say, how good we is your rattle gun? We just had a rattle gun. So, just looking for a bit of brace. Twist. Now there's loads of different places you can brace. You can stick a screwdriver in here, but I'm just trying to turn it around. Get turned, and this is turning the engine. Out. Uh, yeah, this is actually turning the engine. Yeah. Have you got a mallet or something? We did. Trying to twist it. Oh, I turned the engine around here. And like that, we're at the end of the video. You may notice a secondary gearbox in this clip. Fun fact we discovered is that it turns out the 350 GT gearboxes are specific to the car. As opposed to the 350Z and other VQ running cars, the Mechatronics unit is located in the bell housing of the gearbox for the Skyline, whereas all other models the unit is located in the car, and unfortunately this means there's no real way around trying to modify the incorrect gearbox to fit, so we ended up having to source another transmission from a wrecked 350 GT to fix this problem. With that annoying detail out of the way, Thank you all so much for watching and I hope to see you all next time for part two of the clip where we'll be installing the new transmission.